You're watching Seatome TV. Knowledge is power. What is P53? Right, right. And what role does it play in cancer? Okay. Sandra wants to know. P53 was one of the first um, tumor suppressor genes ever identified. Um, they refer to it as a guardian of the genome. So it, it basically prevents, it has many roles, but basically it prevents cells from caulking themselves when they are damaged or when they're growing too fast. Okay, and that's that essentially is what a tumor suppressor gene yeah, is. It exactly. prevents cells from copying themselves. Yeah, and this one is the main one. It's It's got a role in you know pretty well every cancer. Okay. Um, typically when it is mutated in the cancer, the cancer is much harder to treat. Mm. So uh, yeah, it's involved in a lot of different cancers, either turned down or damaged. Okay, all right. They call it the guardian of the genome. All right. Do we have stats on, you know, how often it is it damaged or, or? I would say it's the most highly damaged gene in all cancers. Okay. So if I have cancer, it's very likely that uh, the P53 is, is playing affected. a role. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And how would I find out? Uh, you get tumor DNA sequencing, um, although that won't tell you if it's downregulated. Um, typically, this is done in pathology. People, um, okay. the pathology departments will stain for active P53. Okay. Because it's so prevalent. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. At least they're checking. Yeah. There's no way of dealing with it, though, yet. Mm, okay. Oh, all right. So it's it impacts things, but knowing that that's a factor doesn't really give you new treatment options. Um, it can, well, it can rule out certain drugs ah, that we know okay. are not going to work. Well, that's helpful. I'm not yeah. wasting time. Exactly. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, repairing damaged P53 is where the emphasis is going. And um, right. that the Casper processes is you know people this people trying to repair damaged p53 genes thank you for watching c tome tv subscribe below and stay informed